we be in the city. <laughs> super beautiful day in the city listen new york is experiencing some warm weather i've seen people out here with sandals with flops skirts like me <laughs> it's just it's amazing it, it just feels so good and i'm so glad to finally um be getting some warm weather weather here so that's a really good thing i, I look i love to come on here and ask you guys' advice on specific things that I may be experiencing or maybe you know something that a friend of mine is going through so I just like to talk about it and kind of see different perspectives thank you Lord for that beautiful Jesus filter like you just did that <laughs> um, yeah so I like to come on here and just ask you guys as advice because you know I feel like we're literally all in this together no one one person is exempt right they're not exempt from going through tough situations from going through life experiences like we all go through it every single day so I think now at this point I'm experiencing that word that they call forgiveness right this is hard because how do you forgive a person that doesn't even apologize like how do you forgive a person that's not even sorry or doesn't feel bad for the things that they've done to someone else how do you forgive them and why should you have to forgive them because they didn't even say you know what i feel bad for what i did or if i did anything to hurt you i feel bad let me apologize if they haven't even done that why do we have to like forgive so i'm like at that place you know get to these very interesting places right now <laughs> and then i have to get a little frustrated but that's just my question and i understand and i get it because i know forgiveness and forgiving a person isn't always about that person right most times it's for us because what we tend to do is hold on to the hurt the pain the after effects that the situation brought and it just makes it even worse for us you know so i'm just at this place of choosing forgiveness for myself rather than a person choosing forgiveness from my heart because i don't want to struggle or feel sadness within myself like i have to literally live within myself every day so if i don't forgive someone guess what happens i have to go through that hard time i have to feel upset and angry and frustrated so forgiveness is truly for ourselves and not the other person and that's how i'm just looking at it just because i don't want to go through sad times and i don't want to continue to keep things on my heart that i don't need to have on my heart right so i'm literally choosing <laughs> making a deliberate intentional choice to forgive a person that really doesn't deserve to be forgiven forgave it forgiven but i'm gonna do it anyway because it's it's about me and not that person now gosh it's so much easier said than done a lot of times um it's so much easier said than done that's just the the point blank period uh perspective of it it's easier said than done however i believe the easiest way for me right now to forgive someone is to ask god to help me because the reality is I don't know if I'm like so up for doing it even though I know I need to and I'm saying the things that I need to say in order to wrap my mind around it I don't know if I want to but I should I don't know help me out I'm a little frustrated I'm praying this morning that God just gives me the wisdom and you know insight on how to deal with this but maybe you guys can help me how do you forgive someone that isn't sorry comment below let me know how you do it Maybe I could take on some of your strategies. We'll see. Talk to you guys later.